Did you know that there's such a thing called the line of insurability? Why should you care about it? Watch till the end. Once again, if you're new to this channel, don't forget to click the thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell so that you'll get notified with my new videos for you. I am Argel Tiburcio, a book author, licensed financial advisor, and financial literacy advocate. And for this short video, we'll be talking about the line of insurability. Have you heard about it? If this is your first time knowing about it, then lend me your ears for a few minutes. Okay, so what's the line of insurability and why should you care about this? So let's draw a quick line. So as we move through life, we move along this line, okay? So of course, we begin with our date of birth, the day of our birth. And maybe you're here now. Along this green line, we are traveling. So as we go along with life, we move towards the line move towards the line we move towards the line until such time that we reach what we call this point okay so this point we don't know when this is and what's tricky about this point is when we cross this line we can no longer get health or life insurance once we cross this point along the line of insurability we can no longer get life or health insurance what's the point of this video the point of this video is to drive the urgency if you've been dilly-dallying or procrastinating or delaying getting life insurance and health insurance that's because you haven't visualized where you are in this line of insurability. And the tricky thing about it is you'll never know when you will cross that point wherein you're no longer insurable. So what are the causes of a typical person crossing that point wherein he's no longer insurable? So in reality, life insurance is all about money and health. We have to have both of those so we can be insured. Some clients may have lots of money but they don't have health anymore so they can't get insurance anymore. On the other hand, some clients are very healthy. However, they don't have the budget. They don't have the money to get insurance. So it's end. Money and health. We have to have both so that we can apply and get approved for life insurance. So if there are life insurance agents, financial advisors, financial consultants, whatever you may call them, that are approaching you and wanting to have an appointment with you because they want to present the options that you may have while you're still on this line of insurability, you're not yet crossing that point wherein you're no longer insurable. So give them time. Usually they just ask for 15 to 30 minutes of our time in a video call, especially nowadays if you're watching this post-pandemic or during the pandemic. Nowadays we can just meet online and present to you the options that you may have for getting your life and health insurance. And by the way, of course, I am also a licensed financial advisor. I can help you. I can help you get the life and health insurance that's fit to your needs. No, I don't push products. What I do is I know your situation first. I determine what your priorities are through a series of questions during the meeting. And then that's when I propose a solution for your needs. And if you want something, if you've already researched, for example, I can also cater to that. I can design a customized insurance plan for you. So that's it. That's just a short video for you. You just have to realize that every day, we go closer and closer and closer to the point where in a day after that point, we're no longer insurable. So that's the first point of this video. And the second point is we need two things 
we need two things for us to get insurance. Number one is money. And number two is our health. So if you're in the market for life and health insurance, you have the capacity to get it, to commit to life and health insurance. And second, of course, you're healthy. You don't have health issues. Then you can talk to me and I can customize a plan for you. Again, this is Argel Tiburcio, a book author, licensed financial advisor, and financial literacy advocate. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and click the notification bell for my future videos. Thanks for watching!